Hello again. My name is Yuji Otsuka from Simia Exam. How are you? So today I'd like you to make a very simple uh, teaching materials. It's a charcoal batteries. Usually we use uh, this kind of uh, dry cell to produce electricity. But today we are using uh, charcoal. Okay. So please look at this picture. Okay, can you see? So today we are using charcoal. Actually, this is not a charcoal, but I'll later explain this part. Charcoal and the aluminum can. Then there's water, uh, this is the salt water. With these materials, we can make uh, batteries. Okay, if, then if we connect to the, uh, this kind of uh, device, uh, motor or some electrical algo, we can, <clears throat> this device are working uh, with the electricity. Okay. Then, usually in Japan, uh, we are uh, using charcoal, names a little special one, Bincho charcoal. Normal charcoal, in the case of normal charcoal, we are burning oak tree, at uh, temperature lower 800 degrees. It's a normal charcoal. But Bincho charcoal, a little uh, special one, uh, a little higher grade uh, charcoal. We are burning oak tree more than 800 degrees to 1,200 degrees. Why we use this kind of Bincho charcoal? We are keeping heat for a long time. So that's why we are using this charcoal for, for sate or barbecue. Okay. Then at this time, when I coming to Malaysia from Japan, I try to bring this charcoal and get on that airplane. But I'm not allowed, I was not allowed to bring this charcoal. It's a kind of uh, dangerous materials for them. Actually, it's not so dangerous, but uh, um, it's not good for airplane. So I was confused a lot, but I never give up. So a very good idea hit on me. It's uh, this one. Inside of the charcoal, uh, sorry, inside of the dry cell, we have carbon stick inside. Have you, have you ever opened up the um, um, dry cell. Okay. Also, most outside, we have a metal case that they move, please remove. Then, this, sorry, this vinyl cover, please remove. Then next, this is a metal case. It's a zinc, zinc, metal zinc. Then this is also very, uh, useful materials. Then if you cut it, they open, then spread, we can get this very useful zinc plate. I try to use this one for the, another type of uh, batteries next time. It's a lemon battery, lime battery. Okay, so today, uh, just uh, keep it. Then inside of the dry cell, can you see? This is a zinc metal. And uh, can you see the black powder? It's a mangan dioxide, soaked with strong acid. Then at, just at the center of the um, dry cell, can you see this is a black bar? It's a carbon, carbon bar, carbon stick, carbon stick. Then I'm using this carbon stick instead of the uh, real charcoal. Okay, uh, this is a kind of waste materials. Okay. So, I prepare this uh, carbon stick. Then, I prepare aluminum can. Uh, cut off the top part. Then, uh, this edge is very sharp, so very dangerous for students. 
So I covered with the cross tail, except for only one part. Later, we are connected to the uh, wire to this position, like this. Then, absolutely, then uh, inside of the aluminum can, there are some coating inside. So we have to remove by uh, sound paper, then polish inside, polish, polish. Then it's okay. Then uh, please bring the water okay, into the Aluminium can. Okay. Then this is a salt, a table salt. Then around a the teaspoon, there's a the water, one spoon, two spoon, then no, then stir. Okay, yeah. Then, uh, I collect the carbon, uh, carbon stick um, with a red wire because this carbon stick uh, will be plus four. And then I explain why this carbon stick will be a plus four. Later I explain it. Then, if so, please connect to the red wire. Okay, then next connect to the black wire, uh, connect to the aluminum can, because aluminum can will be negative for data, a uh, data explain. Okay, then here's a multimeter tester. Then we are going to measure the voltage of the, this battery. Then turn to the terminal and this position, 20, maximum 20 voltage. Okay. Then, uh, please connect to the red wire to red, and the black wire to the black wire from the this margin. Okay. Can you see? Now, it's a 0 0.54. Uh, usually, this battery has a 1.5 voltage. So, this is a little lower than a uh, normal one. So, uh, we need more batteries. So, I prepare the second one. Already um, put the salt water inside. Then connect to the black wire, then uh, second carbon stick put inside. Okay. Then uh, connect to get together. Uh, we know two ways uh, to connect to the battery. Uh, one way is a series connection. Then second one is a parallel connection. We are now, uh, we want to make a voltage uh, higher. So, which connection is better? Maybe you know. Series connection is better. So, please connect to the uh, wire minus two plus. Okay, then black wire on the second battery uh, to the black wire on the multimeter. Okay, so now we can get this value, 1.14. It's almost a double voltage, double, double size voltage, okay? But uh, still uh, lower than normal, 1.0 voltage, 1.0, oh, sorry, 1.5 uh, 1 voltage, okay? So we need one more voltage, and one more um, battery, okay? So I have already put the salt water inside. Then the third one, carbon stick inside. Okay, 
So, black wire to the red wire minus two plus on the uh, second button. Then, a minus to the black wire minus four on the multimeter. So now, can you see? 0 0.69 okay. so almost triple side of value of the voltage okay maybe it's enough so uh, today please connect to this this one this is the IC music box this is the from the first acre first is also very cheap price yeah if we open, can you hear? Perfect yeah. song. Then inside, here's a IC music box. Then I take it off. Then put it into the uh, plastic bag. So this is a very useful uh, device for the experiment. So now, I connect to the red wire to the red, red wire to the IC music box. Then the black wire connect to the black wire. Can you hear? Okay, it's working. So it means this battery is producing electricity. With this electricity, this ice music box is uh, working. Here we can hear the, some birthday song. Okay. So, oh, I want to ask you what, how we can get electricity from this uh, battery. Okay. So, look at this picture. Uh, this is the aluminum can. Then black, black, uh, black circle is a uh, uh, stand for aluminum atoms. Okay. Then uh, here is a salt water. So aluminum dissolved with salt water. Then change like this. Then at this moment, three electrons are left on the aluminum can, like this. Then this, this electron are moving to the uh, carbon stick, like this. Then this electron are uh, making electricity. So electron has a negative pole, a negative charge. So it's moving from here to here. According to the definition of the electrical current, negative pole from moving from here to here. So electric current, it's a direction the opposite. So electric current flow from here to here. So that's why carbon stick will be a uh, plus pole. Then aluminum can will be negative pole, minus pole. Okay. Then uh, here is our electron. So, uh, on the carbon stick or inside of the carbon stick, there are many oxygen atoms, uh, oxygen, uh, oxygen molecules, a lot. So this oxygen molecules will get this electron like this. Like this. So uh, chemical reaction uh, like this. Look at this chemical reaction. On the surface of the aluminum, it is dissolved with uh, salt water. Then it will be aluminum, aluminum ion, and the uh, three electrons are left. Then this three electrons are moving to the carbon stick. Then on the carbon stick, uh, it's a, uh, it has a oxygen molecule and the water. Then it can get an electron. Then uh, it's changed to the uh, hydro 
oxygen ion. Okay. So reaction one and reaction two uh, summar, uh, summarize to we finally we get this uh, chemical reaction. Okay. So uh, but the second aluminum atoms, I look at this once more, like this. Then three electron back. Then this electron moving like this, like this, like this. And during the time that this motor is rotating. Okay. Then oxygen and molecules, you get this, this electron, like this. So, um, inside the battery, chemical reaction is happening. Then it's called the electricity. This is a uh, battery. Okay, so let's go back. So now uh, we get very useful uh, batteries using waste material. So, carbon stick, this is a uh, waste material. And, uh, uh, aluminum can, this also a uh, waste matter. Okay. So please don't throw away this very useful uh, waste material. Please uh, use it for uh, science, uh, uh, science uh, teaching. Okay. Uh, thank you so much. That's all for today. Okay. See you next time. Thank you. Bye bye.